Hi, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're all doing well. Just literally popped out of my son today down to a new fishery, Orchard Place Farm in Kent. Um, Multi-lake complex and I'm on lake six. Just gonna have a couple of hours, a little bit of fun using the Guru's A-Class Margin 550 again. Baits couldn't get any simpler for these just quick couple of hours, if that hour and a half. Good old sweet corn, straight out of the tin from Tesco's. And we have got two mil cell pellets which have over wet, which have over wetted. So by that I mean, I soaked them up once, then put a bit more water on them just to make them as heavy and dense as possible. And then all I'm doing is feeding through a toss pot, literally nuggets, of, squeeze nuggets of them, literally like that. And that is it. That's all I'm feeding with the corn. And that hopefully should bring us a few fish. Thanks for watching. Swing that rig out and then gently pull it back. So we just want that rig about 10 to 12 inches away from where we fed. Little indication already, straight away. Definitely got fish in there, getting balls of water around by the back of the float, where they're feeding on their micros. Another minute and then we'll feed another ball of micros. There we go. Come on. A few more grains down that edge. Sweet corn. Chunky F1. They just don't want to give up these F1s, they're like absolute stocky little brutes. Excuse me, Mr. Feels like another one of these brutish F ones. Chunky F1s, guys, on the bag. Oh, that's all right, you go. Do you want to go? I thought you wanted to catch the biggest fish of the day. Waiting down there for you. Okay. 
Get that bite in. There we go. Within seconds there guys, within seconds. Crazy fishing. <laughs> Another one of these crazy F1s on here guys. Yep. Yeah. Bit of a smaller one this one. So we get him in. So that bite was literally within, I don't know, 15 seconds. So you can see how uh, you could feel the weight like this. And you've got them queuing up. in the lip. Lovely F1. Happy days. Getting back. Baiting again. Next to the little reef. Little tap. Lift the float up. Swing it out. And get ready. Straight away. Fish still present. Boils and boils in the water. Show you where the towels are just skimming the surface just underneath, so you know they've got their heads down. Here we go guys, we're in. Another chunky F1. Chunky F1. I don't think woke up yet. I think it's Ratman, he's back spin at the moment. his body the line hopefully Line's just pinged over his fin by the feel of it. They really are little nutcases in this orchard place in Kent. But it's a sign of a real good quality water, clean water, and healthy fish when they fight like this. Absolute nutters. Common this point. In the bag. And there we go. Happy days. <laughs> right again, just get that bait in close to this little reed I've got sticking out. Then I'm flicking my rig out. And I'm just drawing that guru margin float. But I don't want it right on top of my feed. That way the fish are going to come up the shelf in to set that feed and the first thing they're going to see is my bright yellow hook bait, my nice lump of corn. And also, I found today, like just doing it this way with the feed behind my float, it's just stopped so many foul hookers. It really has made a difference. And I'm sure it's because of how I'm feeding.
and like normal just be patient wait for them real fast gut dips and staying under it's a bit slow there that was a decent bite that one then just swing it back out let your rig settle definitely fishing the swim there we go guys Jesus Christ big run there <laughs> That's an angle and a half. Whoa, that is a lump and a half. Oh, bad netting, bad aim, bad aim. Would you like me to help? Got me to help, Dad. No, I'm all right, matey. Five minutes of battling this lump. I believe that you yeah. He's going in the rage, Dad. One, two, and clear. Better angle over here. Is it gone?
seven minutes of battling, Dad. <laughs> Yes! Yes! <laughs> Finally! Oh my life! Battle wow. of the Greats! Get in there! Margin Madness! <laughs> Love it!